Pembroke is approximately 54 square miles. We have approximately 3,000 residents in town, inside of Pembroke Township. Uh, we have approximately 500 horses that live <laughs> in Pembroke Township. This community was founded on agriculture. We're trying to get them back to the soil to start being responsible for their own diets, not being dependent on outside sources for their diets, their dietary nutrition, but being just learning how to grow again, getting connected with the soil that their grandparents had left for them here. Tonight we have our Sirens Fair Gala for our elementary schools. Our students with the human body and they're relating that to the food quality that they eat. Pembroke is an agriculture community, but the ironic thing about that is that a lot of the residents don't eat their own food. Uh, the local school, they don't buy from the local farmers. Um, the farmers usually uh, ship their food to the cities. Uh, the farmers markets are in the town, not in this town, but in the neighboring town. So we're trying to initiate uh, with a new initiative for the schools and the children to eat what they grow. So they're connecting how they eat and how to treat the body good from nutrition all the way through. We're starting a huge reform for our students from the top down. We just purchased a salad bar. Our school has also um, just finished the grant for Farm to School. We have farmers that agreed with MOUs and have, uh, have agreed with contracts to be um, suppliers of the food for our, for our students. So we're creating a huge reform of connecting the human body with, every, with their diet and creating better students this way. They're getting rid of sugar out of the diets, uh, out of the food systems next, starting next year. So we're slowly but surely um, increasing their awareness of how food relates to them. They're learning this year about the human body and they're gonna be connecting that starting in the fall. With gardens, we're also applied for a greenhouse so the students will be able to grow their own salad for the salad bar. Food Patriots, it was exciting to see um, an organization that wanted to connect food and body together. And I've seen some of the clips, and just because we're starting a revolution in this community, getting the community, starting with our children, all the way through our adults, to start reconnecting to the land and soil, we have beautiful uh, country and natural fauna here in this community. And just being able to get people, oh, I am responsible for my body. What I put in it matters. Grow your own food, you know where it's coming from. You know where your source is coming from. And that's one of the things we want to connect these children to food and the healthier body. Absolutely.